What is up, everybody? I just want to make a quick video because it's not said nearly enough as it should be. And I just want to say thank you, Zack Snyder. Thank you, Zack Snyder, for giving me some of the best comic book films I've ever seen. I mean, this guy, in my opinion, is a genius. He's ahead of his time. And um, sooner or later, hopefully, others will catch up and realize how great of an artist Zack Snyder is. Um, this guy works harder than anybody I've ever seen and rumor has it that he's going to be leaving the DC Extended Universe. Now I don't think those rumors are going to be true. While I, I think he's still going to be um, you know, working with the DCEU and Jeff Johns. I don't think he'll probably direct another movie. If he does, that'll be epic and awesome. I'd love to see him direct Flashpoint. Now, come on now. Who wouldn't want to, like... But I think he'll still, you know, um, do deal with stories in the DCEU. Um, he'll still write some stuff, I think. And, um... Hopefully his visual style will still be um, in the DCEU because nobody nobody does visuals like Zack Snyder. Um, his even if you don't like his movies, people love his visual style. I mean, the Justice League movie looks like a freaking comic book come to life, literally. So, yeah. But, um, I mean, nobody had the balls to make a Watchmen movie, but Zack Snyder did. And in my opinion, he succeeded. I think Watchmen is a masterpiece. Um, I haven't seen Watchmen in a minute. I gotta go back and watch it, but, I mean, the last time I watched it, man, it was, like, still a masterpiece to me. Um, Dawn of the Dead, the Dawn of the Dead remake, that's one of the best remakes, um, I've ever seen, okay? Um, Sucker Punch is another good movie. I mean, I think Sucker Punch is a underrated film, in my opinion, and I think he did a very good job there. Now, here's the thing where Zack Snyder is a genius, man. I mean... Every time I talk to somebody about uh, Superman or whatever, they said that they weren't a Superman fan until Man of Steel. You know what I mean? Man of Steel made them Superman fans. And I don't blame them. Man of Steel is a masterpiece in my opinion. That's not going to change, man. I think that Zack Snyder put the best Superman on screen with Man of Steel. No disrespect to Christopher Reeve because I freaking love Christopher Reeve's Superman and nobody will ever, well, nobody will ever be able to touch Christopher Reeve's Superman, okay? But in my opinion, um, Henry Cavill is my favorite Superman. Zack Snyder's Superman is my favorite Superman. And I like how he didn't make Superman perfect right from the jump. He's making him earn his right to be the Superman that we all know and love from the comic books. That's what I love about this whole thing. Unfortunately, some people don't. They want him to be, you know, the Superman that we all love, know and love, right from the jump. And while that's cool and all, I think the way Zack Snyder's approach to Superman's arc throughout the DCEU is fan-freaking-tastic and I cannot wait to see Justice League what they do with Superman that's going to be the Superman we all know and love 
and just, everything's just going to come full circle in Justice League, and it's just going to be a beautiful thing to watch. And it's all thanks to Zack Snyder. Zack Snyder gave us the best Batman live action we've ever seen. He gave us the best Batman fight we've ever seen, and I think he gave us the best Bruce Wayne that we've ever seen. And I applaud Zack Snyder with his casting decisions. Perfect casting for everyone. I mean, he casted the perfect um, Batman, the perfect Superman, and the perfect Wonder Woman. I still remember the day, the day when Gal Gadot was cast as Wonder Woman. And now she's like the biggest freaking star in the world today in superheroes. It's all thanks to Zack Snyder for casting Gal. I remember when Ben Affleck was cast as Batman. The internet went crazy. And now, a lot of people are saying that Ben Affleck is the best Batman we've ever seen live action. Including the Batman himself, Kevin Conroy. He said that, um, I believe he said that uh, Ben Affleck has a great balance of both Bruce Wayne and Batman, and I absolutely agree. That's all thanks to Zack Snyder. So, um, I just want to say thank you again, Zack Snyder, for all the epicness that you have given us comic book fans. I appreciate everything that you've done. I appreciate all the hard work that you put into the DC Extended Universe and everything else. And if this is um, the last movie, if Justice League is the last movie that you direct, um, I'll be sad, but at the end of the day, um, you deserve to do whatever you want to do. And what whatever else you do, what other movies you make, I'll be the first in line on opening day to see that movie. Because I'm pretty sure it's going to be off the chain. So uh, I'm looking forward to Justice League. I'm looking forward to everything, man, that you do. And at the end of the day, thank you, Zack Snyder. So, y'all, um, in the comments down below, give me your favorite Zack Snyder film. All right? And, um, yeah. You want to follow me on social media? Those links will be in the description down below. Um, got any requests that you want me to do? I'm all ears, all right? Like always. Like. Share, subscribe. I'll see y'all in the next video. All right.